Hi everyone, this is Anthony Giuliano with the Linked Institute blog, and today we're going to talk about the feature that everyone seems to love to hate, and that is endorsements. What I'm going to discuss today in this quick tip is how you omit endorsements from your profile. Well, on the screen you'll see uh, that I am in profile edit mode and the little red the little pencil that's uh, in the red circle in the upper right hand corner is a feature that allows you to edit all the modules in your profile endorsements are no exception so if I click on that pencil icon what will come up is something that looks like this now let's say there's an individual skill that I don't want associated with my profile either because I want another skill to be uh, available in place of it or because I just don't want people to think of me for that skill. Well, you'll notice there's a little X next to each of these skills. You click on that and the endorsements will no longer be associated with your profile. Now, in some industries, endorsements are causing problems because they're tantamount to a testimonial which lawyers and financial advisors and others are not allowed to claim publicly. So in those cases, those individuals may want to get rid of endorsements altogether and you can do that as you can see in the section that's circled here you have the opportunity to click on no do not show my endorsements. Now there's one other thing I wanted to mention endorsements can also be added to your profile by virtue of people suggesting that you have a certain skill. Well, you can prevent those from ever appearing on your profile by skipping them and not accepting them. Let me show you what I mean by that. I've blacked out the names and faces to protect those who are generous enough to endorse me for these skills, but quite honestly, they're not skills that are high priority for me, so I'm not going to accept them. What I'm able to do in that case, once I'm prompted to accept these new skills and by virtue of that the new endorsements is I also have the option of clicking on skip and what that's going to do is omit those from my profile and leave on my profile only the ones that I have added and claimed for myself. So that, those are a few ways in which you can omit endorsements. Uh, there's a couple other things I'll cover in the future but those are some of the basics. As always if you have any questions please comment on this video or visit my blog, linkedinstitute.wordpress.com. Thank you.